10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, unité, top. And we have engine start. And lift off. Décollage, lift off from a tropical rainforest to the edge of time itself. James Webb begins a voyage back to the birth of the universe. Punching a hole through the clouds, 20 seconds into the flight, good pitch program reported. Trajectory nominal. 3D animation. We can hear the noise and feel the vibrations here. Your right throat, yeah. Impressive. 13 kilometers in altitude, 7 kilometers downrange, traveling uh, about uh, 0.6 kilometers per second. The trajectory reported to be nominal by Jean-Luc Voyer, the uh, range operations manager. You can see at the bottom of your screen, the yellow line is the trajectory plot, perfectly overlaid over the green line, which was the pre-launch trajectory. One minute, 41 seconds into the flight, about 40 seconds away from shutdown of the solid rocket boosters. Coming up on the two minute mark into the flight. When it detects the threshold on acceleration, the dis not the deceleration, but uh, less acceleration for the Oh, oh, everything is okay. Everything is normal. Two minutes, 15 seconds into the flight. When the threshold, it will separate. Separation des EAP. Done. We have confirmation of solid rocket booster separation from Jean-Luc Boyer. This coming at an altitude of 44 miles. The Ariane 5 and James Webb traveling almost 5,000 miles an hour. We have about one minute, five seconds to go before fairing jettison. That'll be the next critical milestone. So Raphael, so far so good. Hi Rob, so far so good. Everything is nominal as uh, we say when attitude and trajectory of the Ariane 5 is going perfectly well. As you can see also on the yellow line. De la coiffe. Here in the control room, there's your telescope ready to unfurl uh, its uh, wings basically and begin uh, its uh, journey to a, the Lagrange point, the L2 point, about a million miles away from Earth. Extinction de l'EPC. Opération EPC. And we have main stage shutdown and separation confirmed here on the mission. 